The barrel race pattern. Prerequisites. You want the horse to walk confidently on a loose lead. Have done ample horizontal flexion exercises in short frequent bursts, not drilled, which might create soreness. Weave exercises are great for fun with flexion. 67 to 71 horse gym with boots, thin slice of variety of weaving tasks. Number 161 horse gym with boots. Introducing the barrel racing pattern. And we're going to do it using back chaining to a mat. We start at a mat which has a strong history of reinforcement and we walk around the last or third cone in the barrel racing pattern and as we come around we hurry back to the mat for the click and treat. So we've started with the final task which is standing on the mat. Now we're going to walk around the second cone of the pattern then head around the third cone in the pattern. Boots is not warmed up to demonstrate this. And then we hurry back to the mat for a click and treat. Starting again from the mat. Now we're going to walk the whole pattern. So we walk around the first cone. And then we head for the second cone. And then the third cone. We didn't have time to warm up before the filming. And then we hurry back to the mat for a click and treat. We can also ask the horse to circle each cone on her own. So we'll demonstrate the whole thing again. So we head to the third cone first and back to the mat. That establishes the final point in the horse's mind. We start again from the mat. We go around the second cone. And then we add in the third cone. Her turns are getting a little more fluid as she warms up. And we head back to the mat for the click and treat. Now we're going to do the whole pattern starting from the mat. Go around the first cone. And we're going to go around the second cone. I have bionic knees so I can't ride anymore and I can't run but we can work out the principles around the third cone. And hurry back to the mat for the click and treat. So the horse knows where the finish is. If you want to get in touch with me. To ride the pattern, gradually spread out the cones or barrels and increase the speed as the horse gains fitness. Get a nice, get nice tight turns on the ground first. Groundwork to maintain bend and suppleness and confidence with the task. Teaching the pattern with back chaining allows the horse to know where the task finishes, which is highly motivating.